Hello everybody, this is Maniac for Bricks, and I am here today with a remake of set number 2880, Open Top Jeep. This is a town set from 1997, although I tried to recreate it since I don't own the actual set. I was able to make it from identical parts in my own LEGO collection. This set contains 29 pieces, it was originally in a box, zero minifigures, and was not really for sale. This says on Brickset, this is a promotional release. It was part of the initial shell promotion in Switzerland, also available with the newspaper promotion in Brazil in 1998, and in Tesco, the, um, the store in the United Kingdom. Packaged with biscuits in 1999. In the U.S., this was, stole, this was at Walmart as a promotional pack, with four other sets from 1998. So as I already mentioned, I kind of spoiled the surprise for myself that there is no minifigure in this set. So, just to give it a quick look, we'll discuss how it looks to a minifigure scale after the initial review. Let's take a closer look at this set now. As I've previously stated, this set doesn't have... Um, 100% authenticity because I made it with pieces of my own collection using the instructions provided online. Now, I did find the pieces to the letter as far as authenticity, but I can't say that all the pieces in here are from that set because I don't own that set. But this is pretty much a 100% recreation of it. Now you can see it's got a basic design. It has translucent pieces for the headlights and the brake lights. It's got a interesting piece on the front that works for the fender and for the hood of the car, which was common in the late 90s. It also has a little bit of a design on the side. I'm not sure exactly what they were going for, but they're probably trying to make it look like a car door, in my estimation. You also have this large windscreen, and it has room for two minifigures, to fit in there. Now you can see there's actually an indentation for where they can fit or if you want to put a package or some other minifigure accessories in there. Now um, what's strange about this I can't really define it as a Jeep even an open top Jeep just because to me it doesn't feel like a Jeep. It feels more like a convertible or a sports car. When you put it next to a minifigure it's not that big. It's got nice, you know, style to it, and, you know, the wheels are okay. I forgot to show the bottom. But in the relative size to a minifigure, this is not that large. Which would be an okay size, you know, for a car, but not necessarily the right size for a Jeep. It's about the two minifigures wide. Now, when I fit my Sig Fig in here, you can see how he looks on there, and, you know, it's kind of odd. Like, it's too low to the ground as far as a car goes, and for a Jeep, it feels really low to the ground, because usually I imagine them to be much taller. Although it's got some neat design with the red and white going, it's kind of amateur, and it's not too bad to get for a promotional item because of the nice, you know, hood pieces and, um... And the windshield pieces, I can just remove those to show you what they look like individually. But there's not much to this. So thanks for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time with more LEGO set reviews.